Ron Woods learned leadership. This is easy stuff. You don't know my dad. My dad was a Navy SEAL. I'm the firstborn son of Steven Seagal. Now, it's really not Steven Seagal, but you know, my, uh, I'm the firstborn son of Richard Woods. My dad was a UDT, underwater demolition, 1952-53, back when the SEALs were SEALs, baby. Not SEAL Team 6 getting on national news for taking out. Oh, we don't want to cover that. That's right. That's not ever to be known. Amazing stuff. Can you imagine what it would be like? Just go with me for a quick second. What would it be like to be the firstborn son of a Navy SEAL? Come on. Yeah, give me, come on, come on, play along. Tough. P pressure. You learned to swim early. You got that right. You, no one in our family said, I can't swim. He's like, you will now splash. That's right. See, I, <laughs> that's how I taught my son how to swim. Hey, I'm going to teach you how I did. <laughs> um, <laughs> my dad, my dad was the only dad on the block who had an 18-inch buoy knife. And he wore it on his, his belt buckle. He called it his conflict resolution tool. <laughs> you know, you, you think I ever gave my dad lip growing up? In fact, you think I ever gave my dad feedback growing up? What were the only two words I said to my father? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I learned to salute at the age of six months. Held on the crib one hand and salute with the other hand. That's right. Boy, I was good. I could do 21 on push-ups at the crib. Whoa! <laughs> Try to regain my position in the pack. It's one of those things. My dad... I love, things that, I, lo I love things that are juxtaposed, the, the stuff that you remember forever. Here, here's a juxtaposition. My father's a Navy SEAL. He gets out of the SEAL teams in 1960. Right? He was in there for a few, years, a few years. He moves back to El Paso, Texas, right, because of all the water. <laughs> Some of you will get that later, driving home. Oh, that was funny. Uh, and the rest of the people, it was, but it really wasn't. So here's the deal. Uh, my, what do you think my dad went to, to do for a job? If you're an ex-Navy SEAL, what do you do for a job? Come on, play along with me. But you yeah, insurance. <laughs> See, there's a tie there. <laughs> Thanks, Scott. I've already gotten to know you too well today. Um, <laughs> yeah, good. Kind of like a Blackwater. Oh, bad word. Okay, thank you. Um, my dad became a public school teacher. A high school math and science teacher. You think my dad had any discipline problems in his class? <laughs> Only one? Then the head on the stick worked all year. See, nobody gave my dad feedback. Now, my father is also an elder in our church, where I serve as a deacon. And I love things that don't go together. My dad's major emphasis of work in the church is marriage and family therapy. <laughs> <laughs> Imagine going to Steven Seagal. We're not getting along. <laughs> Come on now. See, my dad has that 18-inch Bowie knife on his desk. Here's the conflict resolution tool. How y'all doing? Oh, Mr. Woods, we're doing fine. I had a 100% cure rate. Cure you, kill you. So that's where I learned leadership.